everybody this is Patricia and welcome back to my channel today we are going to go over and review what I got in my BoxyCharm uh, I just wanted to take a quick moment to say since I haven't uh, been on here in a while to say thank you to all of you who left um, wonderful comments and uh, private messages and who sent me cards uh, not only Christmas cards but also sympathy cards I really appreciate that so thank you all so much and I do love each and every one of you so thank you again for thinking about me and my family during the holidays so I appreciate that so now let's get into the boxy charm I've missed filming I really have so do I have a card no I don't know what I did with the card it's been crazy but I do have everything so I don't remember the price of everything but um, let's go ahead and get into it first thing let's go over the blush kit the real her I believe when I did my unboxing I wasn't too fond of this uh, blush kit let me take the plastic off there they are but you know what I was wrong I love these blushes. These blushes, they are really nice. They give me just the right amount of color. I love that I can control the amount. It's not too much, not too pigmented to where you just put on color and you're like, ah, that I can gradually build it. I love that fact and it does last. So, I can't remember the price of this, but whoa, definitely worth it. Definitely worth it. Next is this Beauty Basics. It's this um, bronze essentials uh, bronzing bronzer here, the multicolor bronzer. Um, I remember my first impression was this is kind of cheapy looking, and I can't remember how much it was, but I didn't think it was worth it. The bronzer's okay, not my favorite, not at all. The mirror is, again, like I, what I call a funhouse mirror. When you look into it, it's distorted, and it gives me like a headache. I can't, I can't use the mirror on this. It's, it's just too distorted. It's, it's like a funhouse mirror. Um, the, like I said, the blush uh, or the bronzer is just okay. Don't think it's worth what they think it's worth. But I'll keep it and I'll use it, um, but not my favorite. I certainly would not, if I had purchased this, I would return it. But since I have it, I'll just keep it. It's not bad enough that I want to throw it away. I mean, I'll use it, but uh, I just don't think it was worth what they think it was worth. Next is the mascara, which I did not even open. I just left it in the box. I can put it with my other mascaras now. I'm sure this is a great mascara. This I've heard a lot of good things about the Tarte mascara, so I'm excited to try that when the time comes. Um, next, let's talk about this brush, the Crown Blush Brush. I love this brush. I love this brush more than the brush I've been using to do my blush. So I think I'm gonna continue using this one to do my blush. I do have a hair that just came out I do. I love the handle, how you can hold it, and it's comfortable on your hand. Um, but yeah, this brush is great. I've been using it since I got it, and I'll just keep on using it. It's dirty. So yeah, I like this brush. And then last was this um, lip, liquid lip, by this company. I'm going to do it like that, because when I said it out loud this vi the video it didn't get monetized because of the name of this product this pretty blank product uh, which is crazy that's a thing uh, YouTube has been doing uh, there's been other cosmetics I've used and given out names and it'll mark those videos as that you can't uh, be monetized and you have to go it's a whole process but, um, yeah, so I'm not going to say the name of this company, but, um, maybe you can see it on the lid there. I hope it's coming in. 
color is my lips are sealed I like this I would maybe purchase more products lip products but I have so many lip products right now that I don't need any more lip products absolutely do not but um, this was good this was okay I believe this was 24 it may have been 24 I don't know I can't remember, but I think it was around 24, and I was thinking that it's worth that. It it, it feels very comfortable on my lips, and uh, I like the color, and it, it lasts pretty well, so it's worth it. And the packaging is really nice on this uh, lip, so yeah, it's worth it. So all in all, the only bad thing is, wouldn't like bad thing, but the my least favorite thing was the bronzer and I just think that they think it was worth more money than I think that it actually should be worth uh, like I said I will keep it I will use it but I would not purchase it at that price so but I'm very happy with the blush the brush the mascara and the lip so <laughs> there we go that's my review of my BoxyCharm for the month of December and the last one for the year of 2017. So, thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. If you have any questions or comments, just please leave them down below and I will see you next time.